Good morning. So today we're going to change mica powder into inks. You're going to need stainless steel BBs. That's a 20 milliliter bottle. Um, a cosmetic funnel. Your micas. And 91% alcohol. So what I do is I start off by getting my bottle ready. And I'm going to fill that cosmetic funnel <clears throat> pretty good. I'm going to fill it almost all the way to the top. That's how I judge how much mica to put in. Because I want my ink saturated. So, you're going to need a pokey thing. And then you can stir that around and get that mica into the bottle. And you can do this with any kind of powder. Any mica, any ghost pigment, um, any regular pigment. You can, you can make inks out of anything. Um, add your BB so when you get your alcohol in there, it shakes and mixes well. I use three, but most people only use two, and that's fine. Uh, I'm going to fill my bottle up about halfway. Just because I want my ink saturated again. So, all of those products that I have on the table, well, except for the Unicorn Micas from Radioactive, you can find those on her website, but I have all of mine. Um, in my link tree under tumbler supplies, I've added all the necessities like the bottles and the cosmetic funnels and the BBs. They're all there for you if you don't want to go search for it. So clean out your funnel real well and move on to the next color. And again, we're going to fill it up pretty good. Deanna does have the unicorn micas in 10 gram containers and five gram containers so I got the 10 grams so I could play again you're just gonna put your little stick down into there and get that into the bottle I decided that I wanted more so And then after this, I'll be making a cup with all of them. And they're really pretty. But it's basically that. You just add your alcohol to your micas or your ghost pigments or your regular pigments. And then you have inks. And I did that the same way with the drag show. I did, I filled it up with pigment all the way to the top and then I filled it up with glow powder and filled it into the top so that way there were equal parts of glow and pigment and they've been working really really well I've been really really happy with the results I love this moon petal it's so pretty but yeah um, the unicorn micas you can't I do have a link up in my link tree to radioactive for the mica powders as well. They're really, really pretty. They're very shimmery and very pastel. They're cute. And label your bottles so that way you know what you're putting in there. So yeah, that's all I have for today. I hope this helps someone. I hope you guys all had a great weekend. All right, bye.